Let's review place value. We are going to use a place value mat to learn something about numbers to 100. This place value mat has two different sections, a ones place and a tens place. It also has a place to show what we make on the mat with numerals. To show numbers on a place value mat, we can use base 10 materials. Let's review the names for each manipulative. These are units. They represent ones. These are tens rods, or tens for short. Now let's practice using the mat and the base 10 materials to make a number. We're going to make 29. I'm going to write it so that I don't forget that we're going to make 29. It's a good habit to start with the ones place first. Remember, the far right is always the ones place. This number has nine ones. We are going to count, and as we count, we're going to put our units on the place value mat in the ones place. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This number has two in the tens place. We are going to count and as we count we're going to put our tens rods onto the place value mat in the tens place. One group of ten, two groups of ten. Now let's fill in the mat with what we have made. On the right we have nine units and we write it here. Let's double check before we write. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine ones. Next is the tens. Let's count by ten to see what number we made. Ten, twenty. We write twenty here. Twenty plus nine equals twenty-nine. Did I make the number that I planned? Yes, I did. If you have base ten blocks nearby, try making twenty-nine yourself.